Welcome to Automation Academy. In this video, we are going to discuss about ABB Robot Moves, PP to Cursor, PP to Routine, and PP to Main. Especially if your robot stopped because the clamp, gripper, or positioner sensor was not made. And your program look like this. You see the symbol here, this is the mechanical robot, and this is the actual position. On line 10, move J approach pickup. In joint mode, each axis moves independently. A typical robot has six axes, and each of which can move independently. Each axis usually has two keys, forward and backward keys. And the user hold the shift key together with the deadman switch and press either positive X or negative X. The joint mode is the fastest and shortest cycle time and it is appropriate moves around obstruction. In linear mode issues when you are going to control path between two points. One example is weld application from point A to point B. And for circular motion, issues when robot must follow a circle or arc. Now let's proceed to the next line of code. If you already check and rectify the grip or open fold and make sure that the robot is clear to move, you can continue the process in automatic and manual mode. Let's do first the auto mode. Tap the next line of code and then tap the bag, tap PP to cursor, and you will see the program pointer move to the next line of code and then switch the key to auto mode. Then on the teach pendant, it says automatic mode has been selected. Tap OK to acknowledge. Acknowledge by tapping OK. You will see on the top from guard stop to motor off. Guard stop means safety circuit is activated. Press the motor run button to enable the motor. Note, before you press the play button, Reduce first the speed. If this is your first time here and you like this video, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so that every time I'm going to upload a new video, you will be notified. You can reduce the speed of ABB robot either in manual or auto mode. Click the access menu and then tap the speed icon. And now you can choose your speed reference, 25%, 50%, for example, if you choose 25% and then you press negative 5, your actual speed is 20. After that, press play and now the robot will run in auto mode. And if you want to move the robot in manual mode and you will be the one to control the motion, then let's proceed. Switch the key to manual mode. Press the dead man switch. And then press play. And if you want to move the robot one at a time, the line of motion, then press tap. After you move the robot to home or clear position, switch back the key to auto mode. Tap the key to acknowledge that you are in auto mode. And then press play. That's it, guys. Thank you for watching.